Hi everyone, I just want to do a really quick vlog because something's just arrived in the post and I want to do like a little live vlog for you about it. So I'm wearing this, the next couple of videos I will be wearing this because I've done a few vlogs today all in once just to get them out of the way. So I am changing my clothes, I promise you, it's just that I've done two vlogs on the same day. But yes, yeah, so I have, oh god, I need to, um, sorry, for confidentiality, I need to cover my dress up and also cover that address up but yes it's my certificate guys it's the uni certificate <laughs> so i don't know if this is for every university but at birmingham city university once you've had everything authorized and had your classification authorized that there's a little box that you have to tick and request your certificate make sure you do this guys if you're coming up because i had no clue when you're doing it on your phone that box doesn't come up and it doesn't tell you it was only by chance that i went on my laptop just to check everything over because that's what i do and i saw it i was like oh my god i need to apply for my certificate so yes you have to apply for your certificate i've just quickly just removed my dress off because again confidentiality but i wanted to open this so here we go look it's never been opened before Oh my god, I can't get it open. Oh my god, it's tough, guys. Just give me my certificate. I need a nice frame now for this. Dun, 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 dun. Right, are you ready? Is it just one certificate? Oh god. <laughs> Come on. Right, are you ready? Dun, 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 dun. You saw it before me, guys. <laughs> Oh my god oh it's so beautiful by the authority of the academic board of the university claire carmichael has been awarded bachelor of science with honors first class in adult uh, in adult nursing 9th of january 2020 and then i've got oh you get you have a little breakdown of all of your grades now I don't know if this will help you or not, but I'm going to show you my grades. I, I'm not shy. I'm not embarrassed with my grades. So the, the lowest I got was 54%. Actually, there was, oh, I can't remember which one it was. Oh, it was that one. So professional values and evidence-based practice, which was my lowest grade, which was 54%. So that um, exam came in two parts for us. We had to do a poster presentation with a group, and then we had to do an assignment. And that assignment was my worst ever grade i think i got 45 percent, which isn't on there but my lowest grade was 45 percent. i've got a 54 percent. i've got 55 percent, and i've got another 55 percent. so actually every year i've i've got a 50s mark in one of my assignments so just to show you that actually 50 marks are okay but i'm going to show you my marks so that you can see overall what i got if you can see that there so these are all my marks, guys. Those are all my grades that I got. And these are all the modules that we had at university. My overall score was 69.5. I was on the cusp of getting a first. And this is why I, I wasn't sure what grade I was going to get because because it was a 0.5. I didn't know if they were going to round up or round down. And luckily, they rounded up that little half a mark. So I did get um, a first class. So I was very, very fortunate that I did get a couple of 75s up there and that just pulled the rest of my grades up to get a first. So please, if you're getting 60s, if you're getting 50s, don't worry about it, guys. If, if you really, really want a first, if that's your personal goal like me, just if you get a few assignments or exams that are in the 70s plus, hopefully that will bring your grades up as well. I have to apologise. Dogs are going to be in the background they like to steal the limelight what can i say so they are all of my grades and also i just wanted to say as well like it doesn't grades don't matter i have never been asked in any of my interviews what my classification has been i've never been asked on an application form and trust me i've filled out a lot of application forms compared to how many interviews i've got i've got so many knockbacks from interviews so please classification doesn't matter in the real life world what matters is that you're you're an amazing nurse and you put all of that knowledge into practice and become a fantastic nurse that is the main thing so if you're qualifying if you're qualifying with a two one two two a three 
whatever it doesn't matter as long as you've passed the degree that degree is tough i said this in my last video on my degree to classification this course is really really tough so for you to pass is absolutely amazing you should be proud of yourself but for me this first was as some of you know was just a massive achievement it was a personal goal of mine that I never thought I would get in, in second, uh, just I never thought I would ever get it. So for this to happen and for me to have it and frame it, I'm going to frame it. I'm proud of this, guys. No job cares, but I care. <laughs> I just wanted to say that classification, it really doesn't matter. So please don't beat yourself up. Don't feel down about it, all of that jazz, because it doesn't matter. It really is just a personal gain. It's a personal goal of mine. That's why I'm so chuffed with it. But I just wanted to show you the opening of the certificate, what it looks like. It's beautiful. Look at that shimmer. I'm going to... This is going in my will. I. This is how important this certificate is. It's going in my will. <laughs> oh, yeah.